Hey YouTube, Test Just One here, doing a, uh, another video on a sideshow piece that uh, has been copying a bit of slack also on the Facebook and uh, I I have to say I'm really happy with it to tell you the truth. Uh, not only does it have a really really nice sleeve which is uh, the same as what's on the back, very similar to the Superman. Uh, a sort of speckledy embossed writing on the uh, cover here with the snake, of course. It's uh, the exclusive version. It does come with a lot of accessories, and uh, I will have to go over them right now. Okay, it comes with this. First up, the Mac, is it Mac 3? Uh, re removable magazine. Also, a follow up of two more. With that, you have this is a two piece uh, pacifier, a silencer, with also an attaching. Um, scope. Revolve, revolver. I think it's a revolver. Yeah, it's a uh, got bullets. The barrel comes out. Be careful of this because when I received it, it was quite loose when I popped the revolver and it ended up falling apart when I I dropped it and I have lost. <laughs> A bullet. I'm gonna find it. It kills me, but I'll find it. But yeah, be careful. There's a little plate that holds the uh, mechanism for the revolver here that also come off. I've glued that on. That's probably partially the reason why it was so loose. It seems to be a little bit tighter now. So yeah, so the barrel, um, whatever you call it, spins. It's got six bullets in there. Loose bullets that come out. Nice piece. Stars, you get three of them, just plain plastic, nothing special. Okay, they, they um, I assume, go in his pocket. That's the only place I could find to put those. We have the magazines for the Mac 3. Go in this pouch. Also, be careful of this. When you're pulling it, I use my old tweezers from work that I used to use for separating burrs from sheep's fur. And it's, a sample, it's a sampling tweezers. They're quite solid. I use them for everything, for mucking around with clothes. and They're a very good set of tweezers. I use them to open up this so you can get to the, um, to the stud in there and pull it off without... Don't, don't pull it by the tab, whatever you do, you'll, bait, you'll break it. It does glue quite well, because um, I have to glue that one back in. This one here is another pouch. I, I'm, I'm thinking that this, because if you look carefully, it's got a, quite a shape of a, a tape in it. So I'm, I'm, I'm guessing this is to carry the tape. Okay, so I'm going to use it for carrying the tape. So that's the second pouch. <clears throat> Another pouch here, which is for the uh, pulse tracking device for the he used to track the president. Okay, so that goes in there quite well. And of course, his communication device that. You can pull the antenna up. Okay, that clips straight onto the belt. You do get some some hand, quite a lot of hands. Okay, so oh sorry, you get the the fisted hands. And various other hands for holding different like tapes and stuff like that. Um, all different styles 
you can work it out I'm sure I like that one I like that hand What's, yeah, the pointed finger nose picker mm. and of course the jacket guys this is real leather I've looked at it and I've studied it it is leather it's 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 genuine leather whether it's a, a, a compressed fibrous leather but either way it's leather I really like the jacket it, it doesn't have a zip but I wouldn't zip it up anyway so don't really mind about that I've weathered it or wait when I say weather I've sanded I heard uh, Wendy and Jason from the bomb show say that uh, if you wanted to spruce it up with a weathering you could probably sand it with a fine sandpaper and that's what exactly what I've done I've sanded it with a and, and it looks really good on him when he wears it so I'll show you him wearing this jacket I'll put all the pieces on him now now I've done this video okay I've got everything back on him I forgot to mention the timer device also the cigarette and the tracking device which you can open up okay it, everything's kitted on him I've uh, put his scope and his silencer on the front here you basically just got to disconnect the scope push in your silencer click him back on the um, scope and that locks everything in but everything's on him everything's in the bags speaking of bags it's an these bags are terrible yeah I had a nightmare I broke another stud uh, also when I was pushing this metal collar back back onto the belt I pushed it too far and on the other side of this belt it disconnected the glue that flaps around the fold so it folds around the buckle it's like a little bit of a flap you glue together and that by pushing that too far down I've separated the glue from the from the flap so I had to re-glue that as well yep fantastic uh, a lot of the stuff is really good on it and there is some some crappy parts you know like the, the I'm not happy with the rubber pouches and that but I would have preferred them to be material but that's obviously a cheaper way of doing it and that's what they chose to do uh, in the end I uh, go for the cheaper version of snake plissken then to go with the $200 version which would have been better with a little bit extra on the sculpt of the head the body's fantastic um, they're almost there they just had to do a, a couple other things you know they made a beautiful leather jacket so anyway it is what it is it's, I still I think it's great I uh, love as I said I love the body I think the body's great I love the veining all over the, the arms and the shoulders and it's just good proportion for them too Okay, what I'll do now is just uh, slip on the jacket and um, wrap this video up. I haven't put this gun in because I've just got to find one more bullet for this, uh, which I've lost somewhere. Okay, let's put the leather, leather jacket on. Okay, guys, there you have the um, snake with the... Uh, holding the revolver and uh, wearing his leather jacket. Yep, looks quite nice. I like the jacket. I'm, I'm really happy with the jacket. Yep. Beautiful. So, totally up to the individual. Um, as I said, the belts would have been the belt would have been better if it was material. Uh, I'm not happy with the rubber. Mm. Would have uh, liked a bit of articulation in the in the in the ankle area as well. Um, I find it very limited. Uh, other than that, for the price you pay, you, you can't really complain. I'm 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 stoked to have it, and uh, I'm going to be proud to put this classic on my shelf. Hopefully, with um, plenty more to come in the future. Okay. That's it for me with Snake Piskin. Test chest one out. Catch ya.